Tracy, when it comes to hiring a groom, what processes should be followed? So I'm talking about even a contract, which, you know, I, I think doesn't happen. But what are meaningful steps that everyone could do with onboarding, but even with existing grooms with regards to this kind of information capture? Okay, well, in terms of legislation, in terms of how, how you hire somebody, it, it's it's not not necessarily a requirement that there be a written okay. contract, but it makes sense for there to be a written contract, which both parties understand. And both parties should have a copy of. And Yeah, both okay. parties should have a copy of it. Um, you should sign your groom up for UIF. Um, it's an offence not and to. That's, and that covers workmen's compensation as right as well, no, no, correct? That's no, not oh, is that workmen's separate? Workmen's compensation okay. is separate. So that would also be, be a requirement under the Occupational Health and Safety Act. Um, and, you know, it, taking references, phoning previous employers, all of that helps to instill trust in the person that you're hiring. Mm. But again, we have a problem in the sport where, where grooms will leave an employer because of something the employer has done and come to a new employer and suddenly that, that, that groom's being defamed. It's illegal in this country to give a bad reference to anybody, but we hear it all the time when it comes to grooms because their, their dignity is not regarded as, as, as important as the dignity I, I, I of somebody else. I love how said. It's, an, it's, it's, it's seen somewhat at times like an accessory, you mm. know? So A necessary evil, not part of the team, mm. if I can put it to you that way. Absolutely. That, I need to add something fairly interesting in terms of workers' compensation. So workers' compensation would cover if your groom got kicked or damaged in his work time. Mm. People think public liability covers that. And it doesn't. It does not cover an employee, a second party. It would only cover a third party. Okay. So if you had a visitor that walked past a mm. horse and got kicked, that was sort of not expecting anything. But a groom that worked there and knew the horse is not covered. So any kind of medical expenses incurred from during working, in theory, would be the responsibility of the owner if they didn't have workers' compensation okay. in place. And I mean, you can be talking hundreds of thousands of mm. rands if you're not careful. And yes, you can ship them off to Timbisa, but that could be its own death sentence if you're not careful. Mm. So, and so it it also again. If, somebody, if somebody is killed, and there have been instances of grooms mm. being killed, you can be talking about millions of rand because mm. you then have to be paying support for the family, mm. which workmen's compensation would otherwise mm. cover. But, but I think this exposes a, a conundrum that our industry sits in in terms of the legal staff because, again, from that research from all the stolen tech, over 95% of the grooms were not legal. 95? And that was out of 200 cases. So, And there were a lot of top-end yards. Mm. It, it wasn't, you know, just I'm a plotters. It, mm. and so let's not even go there. So, and, and I mean, a lot of... Do you of think that creates a little bit of like a willing buyer, willing seller thing where the illegals feel like they... Do people feel like they're more adjustable when it comes to salary perhaps I, I think it's a bit like um not getting married you know somehow you can get rid of the person faster than having to go through okay. divorce maybe except, except you can't and that people don't realize that the ccma will even allow a worker who is in the country illegally to claim compensation no 100 okay. well, that's, that's there great might to know. be some psychology there i think the, the problem is people don't can't often and don't know how to resolve the situation mm. or it's just too much admin because it's not easy to get a person legal. I can tell you, not impossible though. Mm. It's not easy to get a person legal. And once that's in place, the rest is is pie, mm. huh? workers' mm. comp, UIF, 